We. So we have the three things, you know? We have a group name, a group leader, and a cheer song, right? To call us Pitu Tatu. Give me somebody like this. Say, ah, ah, ah. So, whenever I put your team, uh, just start singing your chair song. So, are you ready? Yes. Let's go, Tony Gazi. We are the Bogas. We are the Keep on, keep on going, keep on going, keep on going, keep on going, you're doing Cheer team, cheer team, cheer teams, uh -huh. cheer teams, let's go, keep going, 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 Let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Cheer team members, cheer team members. Cheer, cheer them, cheer them, cheer them out, cheer them out. Cheer them out, cheer them out, cheer them out. Cheer them, cheer them out, cheer them out, cheer them out, cheer them out. Give them. Good afternoon, my name is Catherine Wamwangi uh, from Wayok Group and uh, I'm in the HR department. Today has been a great day for us as a Wayok Kenya team where we came out on our annual team building event which was held at Sawela Naivasha. A great turnout from all the departments which is really nice and this year's theme was on staff engagement where we wanted to leave our values and leave our culture where we were able to collaborate through the events and the games that were um, facilitated by us by Team Evolved and they did a tremendous job. After every activity what I loved about it was uh, the recap and the debrief around uh, what we learned and what we were going to take back and people challenging each other and saying what we can do better in the business. For sure it's been an enjoyable event um, from morning till afternoon we could see the energy levels were really high and I believe that it's one of the very successful team buildings that we have had. Uh, certainly, I think one of the things that uh, we were able to do very well, um, we were able to uh, get you guys to understand what we really wanted to focus on this year. And uh, we could see that the kind of activities that you lined up really collaborated and were able to meet the training needs of today. And that is really the staff engagement coming out in terms of the five verses that we wanted to focus on. So we are very happy that uh, it really met our needs. I think, uh, not I think, certainly I think they were because then people are able to take them back uh, learnings to the organization and to see how better they can improve 
as colleagues working um, each other in a great company uh, as WIOC and also reflected back in their day-to-day -day responsibilities. So I believe it's not just a day that has been out, um, out and about having fun but also learning and taking it back to the workplace. I think the trainer did a good job in terms of facilitating such a large group, knowing that uh, we had um, we had to meet all our objectives from morning till afternoon. Very good debrief, and I think each time was allocated appropriately for each for each uh, activity. And what I would like to say also is that the the activities really flowed. You know, there was no gap. You could see from one activity was a build up on what we wanted to achieve. So very well done to the facilitators. Team Evolved, um, you met our expectations this afternoon in terms of uh, having had the debrief before, like what I said, focusing on really what we wanted to do. You were pretty organized, you had enough props and um, facilitators to be able to handle such a large team. Uh, you were enthusiastic, you really made sure that everybody was involved, so we were extremely happy with the kind of facilitation that you put up for us. The instructions were pretty clear <laughs> and I think it was also a very competitive day from all the teams and uh, you could see that everybody was out to win but also out to win in a fun and competitive manner. So the games were well thought through and I believe that everybody is able to take back key learnings to the business and we hope that uh, we will see a remarkable um, performance from everybody. I know everybody works hard, but I think such activities really make people reflect in terms of what they can bring back to the business. As a participant, um, yes, I can say that my, my expectations uh, have been met. And I also believe that um, then as uh, the department involved together with my team members, I believe that uh, when we debrief, we'll say that they've been, exp uh, they've been met. But also based on the fact that um, we are the host, I would like also to hear from the rest of the participants and my team members and my colleagues, whether we met their expectations. But from, from, from an individual perspective, uh, for me, they have been. The most challenging activity that really gave me a run for my money was, uh, and also for a run for a group, uh, Team Red, was uh, making the square with the seven um, panels that we were given. Uh, it looked uh, very simple from the start, but uh, as we progressed, then it was uh, very complicated. And at one point, we also wanted to give up, and uh, we had so many second guesses. But the fact that we took risk, we kept um, looking back and to seeing what it was. Uh, it was, but finally, the facilitator came and uh, supported us into getting the square. And when that was done, we were just like, "Whoa, okay!" And there were great lessons to take out of that activity. You are most welcome. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. My name is uh, Peter Gashoka. Uh, I work for WIOC, West Indian Ocean Cable Company. Uh, I work uh, as a director in charge of accounting and tax. Uh, I must say today we had a, a very good day uh, here at Savela Lodge. The team building was uh, very well organized. Uh, the, the facilitators uh, uh, made it fun, uh, which was very engaging. And uh, even if you compare it with other uh, team buildings that we have done, uh, this one is uh, extremely uh, well done, very well organized. Uh, you have a young team of uh, facilitators and the activities are very practical and uh, you know, they, they, are, they pass very good messages to, to all of us. Uh, and I think you have kept us uh, engaged from morning till uh, now uh, uh, and that's a very uh, good job on your part. Oh yeah, uh, it was very relevant to our needs. Uh, today's theme was about uh, employee engagement uh, and the, the, the activities that were organized made uh, that work very well. Uh, the five C's uh, so I would say it was very, very well done on that part. 
Yeah, the lessons covered, uh, communication, commitment, uh, uh, all that, the five C's, uh, I must say, yes, it was, uh, uh, again, like I said, very well done. Oh yeah, the, the facilitators, after every, after every activity, they had uh, questions uh, and they allowed uh, uh, feedback from, from us and the explanations done uh, made the fun activity now make sense and connect to, to our targets and what we do in the office and how they can help us. Yeah, I would say it was sufficient. We started uh, right on time. Previous uh, team buildings, the, we, we were late to get to the venues, but this time uh, even the, the, the HR team and the event organizers, you worked very well to make sure that uh, we started right on time. So we had uh, enough time to cover all the activities and I would say the time allocated for each uh, was sufficient. Yeah, they were very helpful. I would say they, they, they were very helpful. Uh, we, we learned that everybody in, uh, in the organization is important. You need to, the, it was involving uh, everybody, the teams, the, the, we were grouped into smaller teams and everybody was allowed to participate. Uh, and, and I would say yes, it was. Uh, we, we got the seven pieces uh, to, and we were supposed to make a perfect square. And I must say, uh, as much as it looked easy, we tried and repeated it. We, we decided now uh, to try individually. And I must say, uh, when the facilitator showed us how to do it, uh, we laughed at ourselves. But I, I must say, they were. That was very nice. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Uh, hi, my name is Douglas Njenga. I am uh, the Director of Regulatory Affairs and Special Projects at West Indian Ocean Cable Company, the work group. Um, being the end year team building, I think it's been an exciting day. The theme of uh, employee engagement was quite timely at a time when the company has really grown and uh, uh, the activities helped with you know getting people together after a hybrid system of working and it has really allowed people to get to know each other engage and um, you know get to a point where we are all all working together yeah Yes, so again, as you can see, we, we have a qu quite a young team. So the training was, and, and especially the activities, were relevant to the age group. And it spoke to a lot of the uh, nuances that are familiar to uh, the, the young workforce. And they also allowed us to elicit some of the views uh, that the, the, the employees have about day-to-day -day organization and the work. Yes, the lessons were adequate. Um, obviously, with more time, there could have been more opportunities to explore uh, various areas of teamwork and uh, around the theme of employee engagement. But with the time that we had today, uh, I think they were adequate. Yes, uh, luckily we, we were able to get uh, largely on time. Um, the activities had enough time, uh, but again, of, of course, more time would have been better. But uh, uh, with the short day, the, the activities were sufficient. Um, a lot of the team activities that required cooperation were very helpful. It has helped with uh, a lot of perhaps the employees who have recently joined to interact with 
those who've been here quite a while and uh, to experience firsthand, face to face, the, the sort of culture that WIOC has and uh, the reason why we, we are such a small team but we do great things. So uh, in that aspect it was good, however of course uh, for future ones we'll be looking at perhaps looking at more targeted activities that will uh, foster some of the uh, areas that came out from today's uh, sessions. Yes, uh, I think it largely met uh, my expectations. Of course, from previous uh, sessions, we've had uh, uh, the extreme end of activities where it's extremely busy, and then we've had the ones that are quite short. So I think this, this one falls right in the middle in, in making uh, good out of the day. Uh, the activities were not too extreme. And it also allowed for enough breaks uh, for people to even catch up with work uh, during the day and also give opportunities to uh, uh, rest and also engage uh, in all the activities all at once. I think we aced all of them, but uh, of course being a large team we, we 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 had a challenge with the island one uh, because of the volumes and the different dynamics around the team but we 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 managed we managed and i think we came out of top team red came out top in a lot of these activities so we did quite well thank you uh, good evening my name is nancy ikumilu i work in wayok this is a west indian ocean cable company uh, I had a team of client services uh, managers who champions for client experience and success in the business, ensuring that uh, we make our clients happy, we meet all the commitments that uh, we committed, and ensure that uh, they have positive experience with our services. And if we've had a good day here, uh, Team Evolve or Team Building Evolve have really made um, us work out. Uh, but it has been a very constructive and successful day. Um, they did. I'm actually impressed. Uh, I have a feeling that uh, you guys have exceeded our expectations um, because I know we've done several team building uh, events before. Uh, but uh, we are happy because we saw a lot of positivity. There was a lot of high energy. Uh, teams were able to bond, uh, to collaborate and work effectively. We saw a lot of um, synergy and definitely at the end of it all, there were losers and winners. And looking at um, the lessons we've learned, uh, the teams really could see uh, and understand how you manage uh, losing and winning and how you bring back the synergy to the team so that we achieve the, you know, the long-term goal. I think they were. Um, the members were really um, positive. Uh, initially, we saw a lot of commitment, you know, uh, uh, working together collaborative, collaboratively. And um, yeah, we, 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 all the activities, I mean, looking at um, the critical thinking. The, you remember the, the one we were supposed to do, the three big squares, you know, teams were really hacking it, trying to think, analyzing uh, what can we do, you know. Uh, everybody was given an opportunity to try it out and it was not working and we had to redo it and yeah. I think it was, but uh, not very satisfactory to me. I think uh, you guys had a lot of activities. Perhaps maybe in future we need to manage our time. Maybe our breaks. I'm not sure whether we need to crush our break, breakout sessions. Uh, but um, it, was, it was interesting and it was fun. Okay. Yeah, just that we, we feel like uh, we were really crushing. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the activities were fun-filled and very um, educative. Uh, initially, 
Uh, I think there is an activity which we hadn't uh, understood uh, the, the the instructions very well, but I think when we were able when we were able to call back the instructors and ask for clarifications, and they explained it better, it was well it it was received well, and I'm happy with the team building evolved because uh, you were also listening. Uh, whenever you see the teams are not following the instruction or going the way, we we notice that uh, you. You came through and you know tried to provide guidance and leadership which was really good. I think the most challenging activity actually is the big squares. It really uh, scratched my mind. Uh, we really thought and actually you know, our team we did not we, we didn't manage to, to get the answer because we really tried everything but sometime uh, what I've learned is that keep it simple. When you have an activity or a project that you need to run and you're hitting the wall, don't, don't, you know, change the strategy, try, come back, you know, regroup and see. And sometimes keeping it simple answers all things because it was just a simple move of moving three items. Okay, thank yeah. you much. Ah, thank you. Have a good time and uh, we really, really appreciate all the best. Thank you. Okay, hi, my name is Rebecca Karjoki. I'm uh, the director of uh, projects and procurement in the operations department and finance. Uh, so today has been a great day. Uh, we were able to start the team building event very early in good time. We've uh, enjoyed the activities, a lot of fun field and uh, engaging activities. It was also a great day because we got to meet a lot of the guys physically. The teams that we work, uh, <coughs> we work with remotely, we're able to meet them today and engage and, uh, and gel. So it's been a successful day and also the facilitators, they did a wonderful job. They had uh, a lot of energy and they were able to get everybody's attention throughout the day. Okay. So could Yes, they were very helpful. Uh, the lessons on effective communication, uh, being clear in what you're saying, uh, the uh, comradeship uh, was also excellent. So a lot of uh, lessons to take back to their work in ensuring that uh, we communicate effectively to our teams and ensure that uh, they understand uh, the goals that we want to achieve and we work together as a team. Yes, the time was sufficient. It was good that uh, the activities were not open-ended, so there was a pressure of time. And uh, I'm happy to, to say that my team was able to accomplish the activities within the given time. Yeah, so the most challenging day of the activity was the mind games, uh, putting together the, making uh, the wine glass using the sticks, and the, coming up with a big square using the different uh, shapes. I think for a team, we really struggled with that. Uh, it required a bit of critical thinking, <laughs> but there were a lot of lessons out of it. Uh, I think we had so many cooks, <laughs> and uh, that's probably one of the reasons we we're not able to come out successfully, but we learned. And uh, it actually brought out, uh, you know, characters of different people. <laughs> now they deal in difficult, difficult situations. I think it was a learning experience. Yeah, so um, my name is Benson uh, Joguna. Uh, I'm in finance department. Uh, I'm the management accountant uh, for the networks. Eh? So basically that deals with the, uh, uh, managing the network budgets and uh, also uh, I'm in charge of the logistics. Yeah. So we do a lot of logistics, eh? moving all our network equipment all over uh, where we have phys uh, physical presence. Yeah, basically that is it. Uh, for the day, let me say, uh, we can't thank you guys enough. Yeah, to say the least, we have had, uh, I think most of us the last time uh, we did such uh, rigorous exercises. Uh, I can't uh, remember when. Uh, but I'm happy you have managed to push us to the limit. Uh, and I'm sure you... Uh, could notice like immediately after lunch most guys were kind of <laughs> a bit exhausted uh, but uh, I like uh, the brand we are in uh, if you notice we have a brand of like young uh, some a bit aged people 
So we didn't have a choice. We had uh, to follow uh, what the young tax were saying. So let me say we have had fun and uh, a day like today, let me say, is a good day whereby you get an opportunity to even uh, get uh, people to unfreeze. Yeah, you know, like in the office, eh? uh, most of us, uh, like uh, the way you interact with your bosses, sometimes is a bit, uh, but when you come out to a place like this, eh? you are able to interact at another level. And uh, that, I can say, kind of enhances communication, uh, like in the office. Uh, let me say, uh, for the day, I've learned that uh, communication is very critical. I think uh, we cannot emphasize enough of uh, uh, the critical role communication plays uh, in an organization. So I think that is a key uh, take home uh, for me. Yeah, uh, uh, the time given, eh, I would say even back in the office, uh, you know, even the work we do, uh, there is very limited uh, time. You cannot have the whole week to carry out an exercise. So like in a day like today, the way you had structured the, uh, the activities, eh, that goes hand in hand, like in the way we structure our, our because you, you, you find that in a day you have to do a number of tasks, right? So. The way you guys managed the, 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 the exercises we had, the time given was enough. Sometimes it was even enough, more than enough. Sometimes it was uh, uh, a bit uh, squeezed. Uh, but uh, I'm happy we could uh, cope uh, with the pressure and we are able to uh, manage the tasks within the time allocated. Uh, let me say uh, the last bit, I'm not bragging, the one we had to look for the mines, uh, whereby we, I was the uh, one leading uh, the guy who was collecting the mines, which we happened to win. Uh, it has taught us some lessons. Eh? Uh, the way you impart instructions, eh? Uh, because you can imagine somebody who is blindfolded eh, and you lead him to carry out some tasks. Eh? Uh, you have to be on the top of your game uh, giving those instructions. Eh? So I would say that task uh, really uh, carried me away and uh, I'm happy that I was able to give the instructions in a very precise manner in a way that uh, uh, the guy who was doing the tasks could translate them even without seeing what he's doing. Eh? but he's able to do it very precisely and we came out as uh, winners on that task. So that kind of um, uh, was a, uh, 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 quite an impressive uh, uh, task for me. Yeah. Thank you very much for your time. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. <laughs>
Hello, hello. My name is Matthew Nara, the director, Team Building Evolve. Uh, today, uh, we were here at Sawela Lodge with uh, West Indian uh, Cable Company. We were doing a team building. We had 120 packs here with us. And um, we had a good time. Our uh, activities began in the morning at 9 a.m. up to this particular time, uh, 6 p.m. We are really grateful for the wonderful team that we had here with us and uh, all the activities I have been conducted in the best way possible. We are really grateful for the wonderful team, the West Indian Cable Company, uh, for offering this opportunity to be their partner in uh, trainings and team building. Um, I would like to encourage all of us, uh, the institutions that we have from different organizations, uh, to consider team building Evolve as your partner in, in during your uh, future activities, your future team building activities, your trainings. We have proficient team building um, facilitators and team bu uh, capacity building facilitators. We are really grateful for your considerations and thank you very much.